Hey there, ever wondered what's beneath your feet? I mean really deep down? Today I'm diving into the fascinating science of Earth's layers. It's like peeling back the layers of an onion, but way cooler. Get ready for an epic journey to the center of the Earth. Buckle up because it's going to be a wild ride. Let's start with the outermost layer, the crust. This is the layer where all life exists, from the tiniest microbes to the tallest trees and, of course, us humans. The crust is incredibly thin, like the skin of an apple compared to the rest of the fruit. It's made up of solid rocks, primarily composed of silicon, oxygen, aluminum, and iron. These elements form the building blocks of our planet. The crust is divided into two types, oceanic and continental. Each has its own unique characteristics. Fun fact, the oceanic crust is thinner but denser than the continental crust. Weird, right? It's like comparing a dense brownie to a fluffy cake. Beneath the crust lies the mantle. The mantle is a whopping 2,900 kilometers thick and makes up about 84% of Earth's volume. That's a lot of real estate. It's mostly solid but behaves like a very slow-moving liquid over long periods. Imagine a super-thick milkshake that takes millions of years to flow. It contains silicate minerals rich in iron and magnesium, giving it a unique composition. This is where things get hot, literally. The mantle is like Earth's internal furnace. Temperatures in the mantle can reach up to 4,000 degrees Celsius. That's hotter than the surface of the sun. Next up, we have the outer core. This layer is composed mainly of liquid iron and nickel. It's like a massive ocean of molten metal. It's about 2,200 kilometers thick. That's almost the distance from New York to Los Angeles. The movement of the liquid metal generates Earth's magnetic field. This magnetic field protects us from harmful solar radiation. Imagine a gigantic swirling ocean of molten metal beneath your feet. Mind-blowing, right? It's like something out of a sci-fi movie. At the very center, we find the inner core. Unlike the outer core, the inner core is solid despite being even hotter. It's like a solid ball of metal at the heart of our planet. We're talking about temperatures as high as 5,700 degrees Celsius. That's hotter than the surface of the sun. It's composed mostly of iron and a bit of nickel. These metals are under immense pressure. Scientists believe that the immense pressure at the Earth's center keeps the inner core solid. It's like the weight of the world is literally pressing down on it. So, why should you care about all these layers? Well, understanding Earth's structure helps scientists predict earthquakes, find natural resources, and understand our planet's history. By studying these layers, we can better prepare for natural disasters and make the most of the resources our planet provides. Plus, it's just cool to know what's happening beneath our feet. It's like having a secret map to the hidden world below. All right, quick recap. We have the crust, the mantle, the outer core, and the inner core. Each layer is unique and fascinating in its own way. Each layer is unique and plays an essential role in making Earth the planet we call home. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this deep dive into Earth's layers, hit the like button and subscribe for more cool science facts. See you next time.